Hi, for this recording, I will show you okay, the second point. So we know that when x equal to 2, the power series, let's see what it becomes now. The power series is actually this, this point series, n from 1 to infinity, minus 1 power n, and uh, 2 power n 3 power n n square right so 2 power n 3 power n n square x minus half power n we put x equal to half inside there it becomes summation right becomes power series become this power series now minus 1 power n 2 power n 3 power n n square 2 minus half is 3 over 2. And you find that there are log cancellation. Alright, so after cancellation, this 3 power n and 3 power cancel, 2 power n and 2 power n cancel. So this power series, which is in this case, become a summation of minus 1 power n over n square and this is an alternating series therefore we know by alternating series test the infinite series converge right? by alternating test the series converge so when x equal to 2, the series converge. So we have no one of the endpoints x equal to 2 series converge. Now let's test the other endpoint. The other endpoint is when x equal to minus 1, right? So just now I test a point 2, now I'm going to test a point x equal to minus 1. So let's try. So when x equal to minus 1, the power series in this case, the summation of n from 1 to infinity, minus 1 power n, 3 power n, 2 power n, n square, times x minus half power n. So when n equal to minus 1, it becomes summation of n from 1 to infinity, minus 1 power n, 3 power n, n square, 2 power n, n equal minus 1 is minus 3 over 2 now. Now, the minus sign, which means that minus 1 power n times minus 1 power n is cancel each other. So this is three power, 2 power n, 3 power n, 3 power n, 2 power n, n square. It just cancel each other. And so this is just the summation of over n square and uh, we know this is converging which is a converging p series converging p series summation 1 over np for p equal to 2 so when x equal to minus 1 the infinite series converge when x equal to 2 the power series also converge. So we combine together, so we know that the interval of conversion now, so combine, conclude, the interval of conversion for this power series is x including 2 and including minus 1 as we have tested that it converge from minus 1 to 2 including the endpoint. So all you can write in this way minus 1 to 2. Okay, so the center is half in the case the radius of conversion is 3 over 2. That will be the end of this recording.